We cruising right now. Uh -oh. We're about to get some food. We've been craving some yard house, so we're gonna go there. Get Not red maple? Not red maple today. It's like we go there almost every day, so it's like we gotta give it a break, you know, give some of the restaurants some love. But red maple is all our old faithful though. We're gonna have to do this, walk around, see what we're gonna do. I don't know what we're getting into today, but we're just kind of vibing, going with the wind. Ah, uh, Diet Coke. Guys, I love Diet Coke. I always, I only get Diet Coke at restaurants. I just hate canned Diet Coke soda. I noticed that. But when I'm at the crib or anything, you only see me drinking water. When I'm out, I like to feel special and get a little bit of extra flavor. Treat yourself a bit. Treat myself. So right now, we're here at Yard House, and I got the classic wings. Sweet! Have to. If you know me, you know I like spicy food, and I have to get wings mandatory at any place that sells them. Rob also joined me. Yeah. And yeah, just a quick little break from the day. Lunchtime, it's what, 4.11? This is my first meal of the day. I wouldn't even call it intermittent fasting. I would just call starving. We were busy filming though. We were making videos. I'm working all the time, but it's good to get out. Social distancing, of mm -hmm. course. You I'm should do the flame and hot wings challenge back at the crib. I should. I heard there's uh, like the Buffalo Wild Wings, which is right over there. They have the blazing wing challenge, which is 12 blazing wings in six minutes, no water, and like three minutes after burn, you can't touch anything. I can do that. If you guys know any other wing spots or wing challenges, comment that down below because my Scoville taste palette is pretty up there. This tolerance is high. Yeah, I damn near put hot sauce on everything except for ice cream. It doesn't sound that bad, but <laughs> yeah, gross to others. So yeah, comment down some challenges because I want to do like a spice challenge. I know I'll never be on the first we feast for a while until I accomplish some crazy thing, but that will happen too. Until I'm on that wing show, what are some other challenges I can do because I want to be tested. Yeah, it's just me and Noah. Uh, Ryan's getting a haircut, so that'll be another vlog because I think he's getting like a different haircut. So I don't know what he's getting, but I know he's going to like some celebrity barber that I went to last week. Yeah, He'll tell you the story, but he's gonna get a crazy haircut and we'll see you later. All right. Water. Did your straw? Uh oh. Let's see if they did me dirty. Last again. time you came, they had the sewed up straw. Nah. Remember when the whole world was like, no straws, no straws. And then COVID happened and they're like, okay, just give them the straws. We don't even ask. Because you can't be drinking off of this. How the tables have turned. Sorry, turtles. It's uh, I'm thirsty. We're in uh, the mail room. You guys like my. Tupac bag. You've never seen this room. The first time we showed the vlog, I think. This is where we get mail. So I get a, we get notification. I put in my number, and then it unlocks one of the other doors. I be ordering like too much stuff. I got some new shoes. No big deal. This, this is what I like. Like this is a cool little like system they got for the packages and stuff. It makes it fun almost. And they come down here and be like, ooh, ooh what did I get? There's nothing better than getting a ooh, you got it. access to a new package. You feel like a little kid. So no package. No package. I'm lame. Oh, old YouTuber, we're vloggers. Ah! Let's go see what Ryan's up to. Wait a minute. This mirror is kind of like a magic mirror. The socks is what put my whole fit together, though. So I'll be walking past this mirror and looking at myself every time. Bro. You know why I wear big shirts is because I do sag like really bad. Oh, he's a sagger. You're I a learned sagger. from a whole bunch of rappers. It's like the cool thing to do. It's like now nah, my mom and dad, they always get mad at me. Wear your belt. I do have a belt. I just like wearing them low. And my shorts are too high right now, but whatever. Yo, we've been sitting here for like 20 minutes. <laughs> Does this thing not work or what? It's coming. Watch this magic. I'm so sorry about that. See what I got? Well, I already know what I got. So. Order these shoes. It's the same brand as the ones I'm wearing right now, Naked Wolf. You guys will see that I'm starting to wear this brand a lot. Nice and packaged with the cool Wolf logo. All of this, knowing I'm gonna throw it away. Bruh. Oh, wait a minute. They look like some Air Force Ones. Yeah, they definitely copied the whole Air Force One tongue right here. But that's dope, though. No, nobody got these. That's my shoe review for the day. And the carbon fiber and the metallic material. Oh, those are cool. Great A. So Ryan, uh, we're back at the apartment. Let us know how the haircut went. We we're very excited to hear about it. I might be having one of the worst days of the year. So not a good haircut? <laughs> because I know what a bad haircut feels like and it sucks. Let me stay relaxed here. He didn't do a terrible job. The problem is he didn't speak English, like at all. He didn't do anything I told him to do. I want it like a mohawk shape still, but just super short, because I'm trying to like regrow it all out healthy and stuff. I was like, mohawk was super short, a half if not more even shorter than this, and, and he couldn't do it. And he was too busy spraying using the enhancement spray on it than to actually like do what I told him to do. I can't get too mad because he literally doesn't speak English, but for the amount of money I paid, bro, you gotta do what I say. I was keeping my mustache because I was waiting for my goatee to grow because I'm doing the mustache goatee little duo. Goes my mustache, shaves the whole thing off. It keeps this like little toothpick. And, and I don't grow my mustache hair that fast or that well, so it takes me a little while to get enough like darkness in it. And he just 
took it all away. I was like, okay, okay. So that's um one month um, of growing that I have to do. Again, goatee thing. He didn't say, do you want me to shave this because he doesn't speak English. I said, I I'm trying to keep this. Oh, okay. This leaves me with this pinstripe, small little thing. I was like, Rob, can you see? You can see the thing here, right? I can barely. What? Yeah, what is that, know. Rob? What style is that, Rob? Uh, bro, and this cut was expensive. It, it would be different if I had paid a little bit of money. I'm not gonna go blast at nobody, but bro, normally the problem with a bad barber is they can't do a decent fade. This guy looked like he could really do some good fades. So here it is. Uh, uh -huh, laugh it up. It don't look that bad though. Laugh it up, everyone. I like my hair where it's like wide. It's like a wide mohawk where it spills over. And he just gives me the Hey Arnold best friend cut. And he didn't have the right comprehension either with what you were trying to say. He didn't fully understand. And even he, he was like doing it. I said, and can you just make it shorter? Like shorter? I was, uh, yeah, it was just, okay. You're just sitting there like, okay. I'm not bilingual. I cannot speak two languages. If you're a barber and you don't understand the word shorter, I'm sorry, is that mustache? Botched. Goatee. We're just gonna shave that all off because now that looks stupid as hell. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm trying to hit the, hit up the other barbers right now to fix it a little bit. Maybe I'm gonna have to just cut it all super short now because it just looks ridiculous now. There, nobody's answering. Like, it's how was dinner? <laughs> how was y'all's yard house? What'd y'all get? I love the wings there. Everything may be going bad, but you could always rely on one thing to make everything feel better. At least you're wearing the Rob sock. Doesn't that make everything kind of just cancel out? We. I would be feel more bad if it like looked actually like it was really botched. Yes. When you cut too much hair off, it's like you can't fix that because the hair is gone. It's relatable. Haven't you guys like the guys that go to barbers and stuff, and you know how you like your hair, and they like go a little. You just feel them go too high, and you're like, yeah. He messed up the whole cut. I'm just gonna sit here and pretend like I'm cool with it. And then that was happening, and then then there's this whole thing with the music I've been working on. That is a whole, there's a whole problem with that right now that I'm working on getting through past. You should let the audience know kind of what you've been up to. Does the audience wanna know about that? I think so, because we have a connection with the audience that maybe a lot of people don't, but I, I feel like they, they deserve to know. We'll give them a little tidbit. Basically, the Rhino has been working on a little musical tape, a little singy song tape for a little while now, and I've kind of just been practicing and working on different stuff, trying to find what I like. It's difficult getting into a new uh, space just because it's new. It's like all new to me, but yeah, just there's some roadblocks with that right now. I'm excited. I'm really excited to be putting out stuff for you guys. Yay! I think you guys are really gonna enjoy it. I don't know where the music videos are gonna go or what's gonna happen with all that, but. And we want you guys to be a, a part of the process, which is why we're telling you guys this stuff, which is why maybe we're putting more energy into this than that or whatever it is, but. So that's happening and there's the whole apartment thing and then you know, some email problems, so. Basically, today there's not one thing. Rob, you're like a psychiatrist, right? Yes, I would be like a psychiatrist. What do you tell someone who Nothing seems to be going their way at all. Not one thing. Not literally one thing is going their way. <laughs> for asking for like the audience, if there's anyone in the audience. If there's anyone in the audience. You always gotta remind yourself that what may seem like a big deal or a big issue or a big hardship in your life right now, that it will always get better. And it may not seem as Bruh. big as it is to really how it actually is. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> <laughs> there's a forest last night in the fire due to the fire in the forest that happened last night. It's not as bad as it can seem like it is if it's not what it is. See, and if you just confuse them, they're just like, wait. <laughs> yes, this is him right now. We'll let him be. Hopefully it's something good. We don't need something bad again. What was I trying to say in there though? My words were a little jumbled. Fix, tell them what you actually meant to say. What I actually meant to say. For those that are going through a hard time where nothing's going right. Where nothing's going right. Cause I find myself in that position all the time. Mm. And I always gotta tell myself, you know, I can't be sweating the small stuff. If you got a bad haircut, it's hair, it'll grow out. Always try to look at the brighter side. Train your mind to always think of the brighter side of the situation, the more positive side, because you'll live a happier life. I, I feel like I've said that so many times in the vlogs, but there's a lot of things going maybe negative in my life right now that I'm just trying to find maybe the better side of that and what I can do to be more happier. And I'll end it off with a song that I'll make up right now. Yeah, sing a song for those. This is the Get Better song. Freestyle, off the dome. Days are looking rough. Yeah, they are. But don't worry. You're a star. And if things are looking down, 
Don't you have a frown? You're a king or a queen, so wear your crown. I'm having a good day, it's a great day to be alive. So please, 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 don't cry. Just be happy, don't be sad, don't be mad, and before you go, just please let me let you know, subscribe to the vlog channel, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, edit. Follow, <laughs> follow me on Instagram, Twitch, and everything else, because we're about to blow up, we're about to take over the channel. We're gonna go crazy Might have a baby Psych, I'm not having no kids Cause I don't get a text back I don't know why I'm a nice guy But you know now I'm sad Two types of people in the world Ones that are happy and ones that are depressed The song that I just wrote was for you He just, uh, he just sang a whole Get Better song Things may be going wrong, you know, Ryan. But you got the Rob Sucks on, so it doesn't matter. I am so genuinely just pissed right now. <laughs> I called Ryan earlier, I was just like, oh yeah, this guy's mad. But at least he sprayed you with the spray paint. That's and here's the thing, all we can do is just laugh about it. Because why are we just going to continue to be mad? Yeah. <laughs> it's hair, Ryan. It'll grow back. Yeah. Think about all the pros in your life. Think about all the good things that are happening right now. Why Bruh. Because there's only negatives right now. See, there's not. I guess it's a flawed mindset. There are positives. There's just all the things that I want to be going positive aren't. But if it was easy, it wouldn't be something worth living for. Um, <laughs> so Rob's to be motivational for, out of nowhere. <laughs> it's just, I just want my friend to be happy. It's oh. it's a matter of just just having grit. Like I have to just have more grit right now. Um, every day is not going to be your best day. You're not going to feel great every day. Knowing that it's literally not the end of the world and it's just a matter of, all right, here's the problem. Let's try to get a solution. Because sitting here whining about it, I, wah, wah, I feel mad, I'm sad, won't do anything for anybody. Well, that's what I like to hear. That's what we got to do because we're just going to keep taking steps forward. Are we in the same color right now? Loki? Oh, shit. This is going to be called the Rhino's Pissed Off Vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Signing out. Signing out. Thank you, everybody. Uh, Subscribe and be on the lookout because we might just do something crazy next vlog.